When is he coming to Global? Is a question. I think I've received more than anything I've ever been asked in my life. And that is the tragic tale <laughs> of Lost Fate. <laughs> Actually the most anticipated character to ever release in the game. Um, only because global players could not even begin to comprehend when he was coming. And he's still, he's still, they're still waiting. They're still waiting for him to release, honestly. This man released two years ago on March 26th of 2020. Two years ago. And two days ago, on March 26th of 2022, I made a video on him without even realizing that was his two year release birthday. I actually didn't even realize that until like now, <laughs> like today. I was like, wait, Lost Vein is actually two years old, basically two days ago when I made this video, March 26th of 2022. He launched March 26th of 2020. Two years old. And actually, he's still pretty good. <laughs> like for a two year old unit, I mean, if he gets a holy relic, sooner rather than later, I'm assuming the next few months actually, they can give him a bang in Holy Relic. And I mean, there are some character flaws uh, that, you know, became more and more apparent as time went on. The, the fact that he has like no crit resistance at the time made sense because he wants to be crit. I mean, he had low crit resistance, but high crit defense, right? And high resistance. So he was a pretty tanky character, all things considered. And at the time, characters didn't crit um, as much. So for him, he had to have low crit resistance. But let's uh, let's give it a try for him. I think the best way we can go about this is actually going with a sort of... Um, actually, you know, let's use Margaret. Um, sort of like an ult rushy team, because his ultimate is still very good. You know, it's not... I think I think it's not comparable to like Terry's ultimate or like the new Meliodas' ultimate, Trader Meliodas, only because I feel so old looking for the melee. Uh, only because uh, Lost Vein kinda wanna have like cards in his hand, so sometimes you have to like purposefully purposefully like just you know not use his cards to get his ultimate to be stronger, which can be annoying. While you know Terry and Trader Melee, you ult and it's a guaranteed win. But his ultimate is still very good, and I think it's uh, it's probably what's going to be best for him here. Or, you know, if I get attacked uh, with, like, an AoE or something, I can actually, you know, pop in the uh, the ult. Or, sorry, the, the level 3 is very easily. So, I think it's pretty decent. I would say, you know, he's at the bottom of the list of festival characters. I actually did just make a video ranking every character, or every festival character. And, you know, he's definitely, you know, at the bottom there, but, like... Even being at the bottom, he's still very good. Okay, King is gonna absolutely destroy me. Um, concerning. Very concerning. Uh, but... It is what it is. We'll see what happens. He's gonna double rank up. Is he? Hmm. See, I... I can potentially, right? Oh, he's gonna... He's gonna <laughs> He's gonna, like, level 3 shield next turn. Okay, okay, okay. So, what we're gonna do is this. No, he can't shield. He's going for a stun. We're gonna go for this, right? We're gonna go for this. We're gonna go for a, a DN and melee ult combo here, right? I attacked Liz so that he couldn't push ult for her so easily next turn. And he can stun the end, but I can cleanse. So that's my idea here. Is he gonna double stun? No, he's gonna shield. He's gonna shield. Surely. Yeah, he shields with King. Wait, is he, is he gonna double stun? Like, stun my Margaret? No, okay. He's shielded with uh, King. I mean, he's dead. Mali has damage increase on his ultimate, which makes so it's gonna be actually no, I think I think I'll ult with the end first because I actually want to see Mali's true damage, only because of that. But Mali's ultimate would actually break the shield with not much difficulty. Oh, 
and then Mally's ult obliterates. I have two cards for Mally, so we should actually kind of wipe. King will survive, because he's going to get revived, yep. But hey, you know, that, th that guarantee type advantage is actually kind of nice, you know? Salt Mally? Oh no! What will I ever do against Assault Melee? The best festival in the game. Oh no. <laughs> How could I ever come out of this situation alive? I think it's impossible. I think we lost, guys. I don't I don't think there's a way of winning this. I mean, I think Maybe if I ult, I could kill, but that's just a guess. I could be wrong. He's putting everything on his power. <laughs> Please. Put the shield. Put the counter. One thing I never understood, but I think I'm almost certain on, is that if you attack with melee after the ult, the card that you have in hand still counts for the ult. Oh, I'm actually not kill. Yeah, because of uh, Chandler's lore. I'm still... I'm still immune to basically anything here, because Chandler's ultimate sucks, but... Maybe, maybe not. Maybe I, I shouldn't have attacked with Mally there. I'm actually very unsure. I've, I've always been unsure about that, because it's never really cl clarified. I guess I, I would have to like go out of my way to test it, right? Yeah, AoE with Mally, please. Thanks. Uh, level 3, nice. Oh no, Assault Mel is so good. He is not in any way the most shafted character in the game. Trust, he's really good. Okay, Lost Vein. That, that's a little embarrassing. TikTok? No, Assault Mel. TikTok? Am I gonna be on TikTok? Damn. Okay, not as lucky with the cards this time. Mm. I'm still gonna go for this. Yeah, as you could see from the level 3, uh, Melly's damage isn't something to boast about these days, unfortunately, right? But it is what it is. He's going for Melly's ultimate. Okay, he's not. See, <laughs> I would attack with Melly, but we saw like last match how little damage I did. It's just kind of not worth it, right? It's just kind of not worth it. Okay, let's go with uh, this. Boop. 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 No point in going for Dian's ultimate, really, because he's just going to take it off anyways. Got a damage increase. I got three cards in hand. This time, let's not actually use the cards. You can kill Dan, I don't care. I actually don't care. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna try to break the shield first, and I'm gonna do this, so I have four cards in hand. <laughs> I have four cards in hand. Why are we still here? Just to suffer? Yeah, I don't know about that one. I, um... I, I I know I should, I acknowledge that perhaps I shouldn't have been so ignorant and followed up with the attack. But come on, I had four cards. I had four cards. I I was allowed to be ignorant, okay? And not follow up with an attack. Like I I expected Meliodas to kill regardless. I think I'm I'm thinking too much of the past. Where Meliodas was a guaranteed kill every time, and that's just not it these days, right? 
Mali is just simply not a guaranteed kill every time anymore. It's just, it is what it is, you know? I, uh, maybe I was thinking too highly of him, actually. <laughs> Um, I, I want to use the melee ultimate here, so I'm gonna go with, um, with this, because I'm not sure that I can actually do enough with just one card now, actually. Maybe I was thinking too highly of him. I should have followed up with the attack, I know, I know, but like, I had four cards! Four! I'm gonna be on TikTok. Oh my god, this is the worst thing that could ever happen to me. Four cards! How can Lost Vein not kill with four cards? Okay. I... Am I expecting too much again? Maybe I am. <laughs> mm. Screw it, I'm, I'm going for it. And I'm gonna follow up with... If Melly kills the end, then... Margaret can go for Melly. Okay. Okay, that's more of what I expected, you know? I mean, it wasn't enough to kill anyone, but I only had two cards. See, back in the day, if I told you that I ulted with Lost Vein and I didn't get a wipe, you'd be like, was it 1 6? <laughs> like, come on. Oh. Should I just back out? I think I'm gonna be wiped in the first turn. Let, let's watch this. Let's watch this. Um, he got a level two. Okay, it's a it's a it's a combination for Gaffer. It's not it's not King. Let's watch this unfold because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna die in the first turn. I am almost 100% positive. This is it for me. Let's uh, let's see this. He ranks up King. Ah, oh, he's gonna hurt. Oh, <laughs> Melly. I think this is the first time I see Yuna take more damage in the end. I am so impressed I survived. Um, you know what? I think this might not be the end. I mean, I my Mel is dead. There's no way around that. But I think if he got very unlucky, if he got very unlucky on his cards. Oh, he's still gonna... They didn't really think about Ludosia. If he got zero king cards this turn, potentially I could survive. Oh my god, you got level 3 UE for... Ludo? No. Level 2. Yeah, I knew that was gonna hurt. He should have done the opposite. Why do he do the opposite? What? Why did he not do the opposite? Um. Hmm. I'm gonna go for this. I need to ult with the end. I wanted to actually uh, attack with the end first to get use out of her ultimate gauge, but you're kidding me. Okay. Dian's ultimate is pretty nutty at 6-6. Six, six. Attack Gaffer. Attack Gaffer. Attack Gaffer. Okay. Ga okay. That's fine. My defenses aren't lowered anymore. Um. Yeah. See. This is why I was saying that I shouldn't quit, because I can still win the match. And I was 100% confident on the power of my characters. Last match. Let's end this off. Green Shen. Oh, Green Shen's gonna have a lovely time against my Lost Vein here. Let's, um... Do this. Get the melee ultimate. Very nice, very nice. Oh, he already got four debuffs, actually. Maybe I should have used the card for Melly. Oh, this is gonna hurt. I'm gonna cleanse the debuff. But I, I'm, a I'm actually might die. Melly might actually die here. Oh, I actually... <laughs> both my Margaret and Melly could die here, actually. Okay. 
Shin did more damage than Lilia. It's insane how Shin... No. I'm gonna have to buy another PP stand with a goddamn... It's insane how good of a combo, you know, Lilia plus Shin is. Of course, I wouldn't use that Melascula that he was using, but other than that... Oh, please crit my Melly twice so I can double AoE. I would love that. Let's see what he does here. Is he gonna go for the kill on Melly? No. No, why? Why? He's the worst character here. He's the worst character of the bunch. Why would you go for him? It makes no sense. Why would you not go for Dan or Margaret? He is by far and away the worst of the, the three. <laughs> this is so scary. <laughs> uh, I mean, Dan's dead. She's not a very good tank. Unless he only has a level 1. Oh, that's fine. I thought he had like a single target. How are you gonna... How are you gonna misplay like that, bro? How? Um... I'm gonna actually do this. I'm gonna make sure the melee dies here. Doing the attacks first, because the more ultimate gate she has, the more damage she does. Mm-hmm. Just like that. How are you gonna misplay? I'm gonna have to buy another PP stamina. How are you gonna misplay like that? Was there a chance that somehow, some way, he actually thought it was Trader Melly? No, right? No, it doesn't even look like it. Like it's red. It's different clothes. Like th there's no wings. Like the. I'm trying to find a way to explain why he would go for Lost Vein. Is Lost Vein that scary? Did he have trauma? I think that was trauma. That might have been trauma. Scary boy Lost Vein is. Anyways, even if, if this guy quits, I'm just gonna end the video. I don't care. I don't, <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I'm done wasting my friend points on PvP stamina. Crit! Crit, 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 crit! Yes! Okay. Now. There's no way he's gonna die to Melly's AoE, right? No way. Okay, Melly single targeted. Good. Good. Um, I'm trusting that you're gonna wipe Melly. Like, I'm just trusting. But, like, I don't know, man. That I had four cards that time. <laughs> Four cards, man. Why did he wipe this time? I'm so confused. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. Can't believe I actually won five win streak here. We've lost Vayne. But I mean, Dn and Margaret did do a lot of the work, but still.